Give me a little rundown of what this documentary is about. Uh, the Nita Zita Project is about 1920s Jewish burlesque dancers, Nita and Zita, who traveled around the world performing in 1920s and 30s and 40s, and then became recluses and New Orleans outsider artists. This, one, this documentary is fantastic, so captivating. How did this story first come to you guys? Uh, we learned about Nita and Zita back in the 90s because I had a burlesque act based on them, an acrobatic contortionist burlesque act. How difficult was it to, you know, get all this research together and put it together in a way that is extremely captivating, is extremely impactful? It was extremely difficult. Marcy was amazing. <laughs> she was like, obsessed with the subject matter, Nita and Zita. For months and months, she just obsessively researched. And um, she's an amazing storyteller. She's written five books. And so with all that knowledge of storytelling, creative writing, she graduated with a degree in creative writing from Stanford and was able to put it all together in a very captivating way. How difficult was it to get some of the stories from when they were re uh, recluses out in, on their own? Um, we, after they died, their neighbor found thousands of handmade costumes. So those costumes went out into the world and then we heard, started hearing legends. But now that everything's starting to get digitized, I went to all over New York, um, Boston, Genealogical Societies, the Historic Center in New, um, New Orleans, and was able to find and piece together their story. So the film uses a lot of archival footage. It also uses a lot of graphic art. Um, we have a lot of amazing graphic art that was done by our graphic designer, um, Mark Scarella. He was amazing. We got really creative with the visuals in order to tell the story because we didn't have a ton of footage of them. Some of the locations, like their house, it's it's like on, oh, their own character. They have such a life. Uh, what was it like for you guys to step into put inside their house and kind of get you know a visual of what their lives were like? It has been an incredible journey. It's been just so transformative for both of us and healing for both of us. And you know, it's a glimpse of history that I think is really important to give a voice to unsung heroes and muses that nobody knows who inspired so many people and have impacted so many other artists just by the way they lived. Awesome. Well, thank you very much for your time.